everyone myself sanvit shetty i am studying in fourth grade b section today i am going to explain about hydroelectric power there are many ways of producing electricity they are hydro hydro energy thermal energy wind energy solar energy atomic energy tides energy etc now i am going to tell you the uses of this energy tides energy in tides energy the electricity is produced by with the help of the height of the waves in solar energy the electricity is generated by the help of sun's heat in hydro energy the electricity is generated with the help of fall in water from higher level to lower level in thermal energy the the electricity is generated by 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 the burning of coal in hydroelectric power plant are designed for producing electricity with the help of with the help of flow of water we all know that 75% of the land is covered with water that's why water is the main source available here the important parts of hydroelectric power plant are the reservoir water turbine generator power house transmission lines now i'm going to tell you the uses of this parts of the hydroelectric power plant the reservoir it is where the water is stored or fallen water from higher level to lower level example jod falls the water turbine the equipment used for generating 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 kinetic energy as soon as the water falls from higher level to lower level the generator the generator generates electricity by converting mechanical energy into electrical energy the power house the power house it will store the energy generate electricity generated here and then distribute through the transmission lines or power lines